everybody, happy Tuesday. Hope you're doing very, very well. Two videos this week. And before I jump into the opening, I just want to obviously announce that Chelsea have got a new front shirt sponsor now. Gross 3, it's now Infinite Athlete, whoever they are. Um, so I can actually buy some of their shirts. How exciting. However, I don't know if you've noticed, Chelsea have not been doing too greatly this season. Um, so I'm going to say once Chelsea win three games in a row, then I will start buying their shirts because, you know, if you're only going to put in the minimum amount of effort, so am I. Uh, we were on one win right now at the time of recording, so it's very possible it could be just two more games away. Um, but I, I think that's probably not going to be the case. I really hope that happens this season. I don't really want to have to wait that long. Uh, we might revise that towards the end of the season if it's that desperate. But other than that, I have a shirt to open up here. It's a week of very simple shirts, really. Nothing too crazy going on, but um, you never know what you find in these parcels. So let's get into it. Ta-da! Goodbye. So... Uh, there we go. Cool. Oh, there's a bit of a stain on that one. Um, so we have... Oh, it's another one of those shirts where it's all white with absolutely nothing else there. Who's it going to be? Let's bring around to the front. Ooh, doo -doo. There we go. There's the shirt, my friends. So we have this black and yellow sort of strip that runs down the front. It seems to be of... <laughs> Sort of plastic transferred on there. You had a sponsor. You got these this uh, sort of siliconed badge. The only thing I did notice, I thought it was a star first above the crest, but it's just like some sort of stay in there, which makes sense because I did get it from one of those um, second-hand retailer websites. Hmm. How am I going to get that out there without ruining the tags? I'll figure a way. I'm sure. Um, but there's the uh, the manufacturer. You probably recognise it because they've been on this this channel quite recently, quite a few times. Uh, but this time, instead of the black squares. They've gone for the white, which I think, I don't know, that's quite cool, actually. It's quite a stealthy one. But other than that sort of band running down the front, it's a relatively um, simple one, shall we say. But uh, yeah, if you recognise the crest, well done. But I will dress the mannequin and show you a little bit more about the club and the shirt. Realise I didn't have a light on for the first half of the video, so you should actually be able to see my face now and also the shirt. But the shirt is for a team called Ali Mania Aachen, and this is their away shirt from 2021, 2022, so a couple of seasons old now. And I bought this one from Vinted, yes, another one of those sort of reselling sites like an eBay or a Depop, etc. Only cost me £12, so that's a great price, that is, even for the little bit of a stain above the crest there. Now, the club was founded in 1900 and come from the city of Arkham. Kind of makes sense, doesn't it, really? And one of their nicknames is it's actually quite funny. They're called the Potato Beetles. That's definitely one of the best nicknames I've seen. It's because of this band you see here, this black and yellow band that runs on their shirts, etc. And it kind of looks like the actual insect itself, which, yeah, I can see what that is. Now, the club currently plays in the fourth tier, and they have probably one of the biggest stadiums any fourth tier team has around the world, with a capacity of 33,000 potential attendees. Yes, not quite sure that they're probably filling it right now, but, you know, it has the potential. Now, this season, the club has started fairly decently. It's pretty solid. They're kind of mid-table-ish. I'm sure that they would wish that they'd convert some of those draws into wins and push a little bit further at the league. Last season, they finished in eighth, so, you know, they're quite clearly a solid team in the fourth tier. They have been in the Bundesliga, and most recently that was in 2006-7. Uh, they only did manage to last one season, though, unfortunately. However, let's just pause and look at that league table for a second. I mean, Stuttgart and Schalke fans, what went so wrong? Imagine supporting a team that was at the top of the league, winning titles, and then finding themselves so far down the league table. Can't imagine that whatsoever. Um, also, a little bit of note for this club, Arsenal star Kai Havertz spent a year there during his youth. So, you know, big things come from Arkham there. Um, now, this was the first season the club partnered with Capelli Sport. Capelli Sport seemed to have that sort of hand on sort of lower German-speaking sort of teams. And it kind of follows the pattern of most of the other ones we have. Simple but this one at least has this yellow and uh, black band running down the front, which is not only the sort of colours associated with the club, it's actually the flag from the city of Aachen. It's just simply, if you tilted it 90 degrees, that's what you would see. Um, a lot of their home shirts are actually pretty cool. 
a little bit more detail put into it, which is not unsurprising. It's their home shirt. Uh, but sometimes, you know, when you're spending £12 on a shirt, at the end of the day, it's you kind of just take what you can, really. It's it's just 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 it was a great price. Um, so that's kind of it, really, to add to it. It's a fourth tier German team. I'm slowly adding more German teams to my collection. I think I'm probably getting close to what's 40 or so now. So we're getting there. We are definitely getting there. So simple, but you know what? It's just adding numbers. So I will see you on Friday with another quite cool shirt, a little bit of a more, I don't know, popular team, shall we say. And yeah, that's it really. So I hope you have a great week ahead. Uh, thank you as always for watching, and I'll see you then. Goodbye.